Hello friends, welcome to MATLAB School. In this video, we are going to simulate the uh, current control of uh, switch reluctance motor or SRM motor using uh, PA controller. The same model is available for download in the link given in the description. If you want, you can download and use it for your purpose. Let us get into the uh, simulation part. <coughs> Uh, we are going to do uh, the current control of uh, SRM. SRM. So uh, the motor we have taken is 8 bar 6. That is it has got 8 uh, stator poles and 6 rotor poles. And it's a 4 phase uh, uh, motor. Uh, here we are having a battery supply which supplies uh, DC supply to the converter. And this converter will give uh, the corresponding signals to the faces and uh, uh, this is the torque and here what we are doing is we are just measuring the speed and that is converted to uh, uh, the corresponding pulses okay so basically we are going to implement uh, this right so before that before getting into the simulation part uh, yes okay uh, we need to understand something about the step angle uh, the step angle is the angle uh, rot uh, i mean the rotated by the rotor for uh, each switching of uh, phase okay when one switch is one phase is switched uh, there will be a certain rotation okay rotation in terms of degrees so to calculate the angle of or the degree of rotation uh, we have to use this formula the formula is 2 into 180 by qr where q is the number of stator faces and nr is the number of rotor poles so for our motor uh, the step angle uh, will be 15 degrees <coughs> uh, so uh, every uh, i mean every uh, switching the step angle will be 15 degrees so for four faces the total step angle would be uh, 60 degrees 15 plus 15 plus 15 plus 15 it would be 60 degrees okay yes so with that understanding uh, let me explain uh, this one we are measuring the speed uh, then it will be converted to uh, degrees okay we are measuring the speed and then it will be converted to degrees it is integrated okay the degrees are integrated and we are dividing it by 60 okay so 60 corresponds to one cycle one cycle of uh, phase phase switching right so this total degrees are divided by 60 and uh, the output will be uh, output of this mod block will be in between 0 and 60 okay 0 and 60 see here we have another one thing called dual angle see dual angle is the angle between turn on and turn off of the uh, particular uh, uh, switch okay uh, see see here we have uh, uh, we can set any uh, value of uh, these two things but the difference should be uh, the same okay uh, see here uh, uh the value of turn on is turn on angle or alpha is 38 and <coughs> turn off is 53 um, and you, even we can have 30 and uh, 50 here the thing is the angle should be uh, the same okay the angle is 15 here uh, even we can keep 0 and 15 the only thing that we should uh, take care of is the uh, difference okay yes let us get into the simulation uh, see this is the model that we are going to uh, simulate uh, here we are getting the speed and the set speed is 1500 1500 rpm uh, see here we are getting the speed in terms of radians per second so it will be converted to uh, rpm rotations per uh, minute okay so we are giving the same input the same thing is given 
I mean, uh, it is uh, taken and it is taken as, uh, I mean, I, I mean, it is given as input to this uh, comparator. <coughs> right. So the same speed is taken out and it is given as simple input to the comparator. So here we are uh, uh, converting the speed to radians per second. Uh, then here we have the integrator. Uh, this will integrate the degrees and here we have the modulus block this modulus block will uh, convert the degrees in between 0 and 60 okay since we are dividing it by 60 degrees right and as i told uh, told you earlier we have two angles turn on and turn off of uh, uh, switches okay so it will be the difference should be 15 degrees uh, so as I told you earlier, the angle can be anything and it should be in between 0 and 60 degrees and the difference of alpha and beta should be uh, 15 degrees. <coughs> okay. Uh, then based on the values of uh, alpha and beta, uh, uh, the signals will be generated. Okay. The signals will be generated and it's given as... Uh, one of the inputs uh, for this multiplayer block okay what here we are doing is uh, just we are comparing the reference speed and the actual speed the error is taken and it is manipulated with the pa controller okay see the output of the pa controller is again multiplied with uh, this sigma see the output of this is multiplied with this one okay right then uh, uh, we are uh, uh, comparing the output this becomes the reference current and uh, the actual current see here the current stator current is compared with the reference current so here the stator current becomes the actual current and this becomes the reference current the output of this multiplayer block will becomes the reference current okay so uh, the difference in current is given as input to this uh, uh, hysteresis controller okay so this hysteresis controller will have upper bound and uh, lower bound or upper limit or lower limit uh, okay so when the upper value crosses uh, 0.5 uh, uh, this will happen switch will get turned on so uh, like the same way in the other side when the error goes below point uh, minus point 0.5 the switch will get turned off right okay so before uh, simulating it we need to give uh, the reference time or uh, step time t is equal to 2 8 1 minus 6 okay. t is equals to 2 a power minus 6 right so we are uh, uh, we have given the time period then here we have the converter converter design this is for phase a this is basically an asymmetric converter so we have uh, uh, blocks for all the uh, four phases so let us simulate it yes the simulation is running it is yes it is getting compiled initializing yes it is running Thirty six percentage. Let us try to open the block. Yes. Uh, see the given input speed is reference speed is thousand five hundred rpm. So you can uh, see it settling at thousand five hundred rpm exactly. Right. This is thousand four hundred and this is thousand six hundred. And the speed is getting settled in between thousand four hundred and thousand six hundred. Right. And we can see the current. So these are the four different phase currents. Phase A, phase B phase c and phase d are the first phase second phase third phase and fourth phase you can have it this way right so 
uh, this model is available for a download in the link given in the description if you want you can uh, download and use it uh, please uh, subscribe our channel and uh, support us uh, so we'll do if you want any models please do visit our website www.matlabschool.store thanks for watching our video thank you